Hello, and welcome to this short story about the life and work of César Vallejo, one of the most important poets in the Spanish language. Born in Peru in 1892, Vallejo was a writer who struggled to find his place in a world that was often hostile to his creativity. Nevertheless, he persisted, and his legacy lives on today. Vallejo began his literary career as a young man in Lima, where he published his first poems in local newspapers. But it wasn't until he moved to Trujillo, a small city on the northern coast of Peru, that he found his true voice. There, he wrote a collection of poems called Los Geraldos Negros, The Black Messengers, which he published in 1918. The poems in this collection are bleak and pessimistic, reflecting Vallejo's sense of alienation and despair. Despite the darkness of his early work, Vallejo remained committed to his art and continued to write throughout his life. He lived for many years in Europe, where he was a part of the literary scene in Paris and Madrid. During this time, he wrote some of his most famous works, including Trills and Palmas Humanos, Human Poems. These collections are marked by a sense of social consciousness and political engagement, as Vallejo grapples with the complex issues of his time. Vallejo's poetry is known for its powerful language and its ability to capture the essence of the human experience. He often used unconventional techniques, such as fragmentation and dislocation, to convey his message. He also drew heavily on his personal experiences, including his struggles with poverty, illness, and discrimination, to create works that spoke to the common people. In conclusion, César Vallejo was a poet of the people, a writer who used his talent to give voice to those who had been marginalized and oppressed. His work is still relevant today, reminding us of the power of language to connect us to our shared humanity. Thank you for listening to this brief tribute to one of the great literary figures of the 20th century.